Hey guys, it's Chris here. I just want to do a real quick video for you guys. You know, I, I had gotten some button quail uh, a few months back, some babies that I would raised up, and just wanted to do a quick little video on them as well. I know there's lots of people out there that enjoy button quail and and all the, you know, they're a great addition to have in any aviary. They're, they're calm, they're relaxing, they're not aggressive towards other birds. You know, they're, they're really fun to have and so, um, in this cage, you know, I can zoom out a little bit here. I have three hens and, and one male. So that's my male there preening himself, and that's the female. And then I have a, a gray hen over here. And then in here, actually, inside these plants right there, I have another gray hen, and she's sitting on about 12 eggs. So um, I've been hoping that that the button quail would start sitting on their own eggs you know button quail are known to to not incubate and hatch out their eggs very often because they've been so domesticated you know i've i've had button quail hatch out eggs before and have not had an issue with it you know that i've it's been pretty easy um one thing i have tried to do with the button quail to, to try and stimulate them sitting on their own eggs is adding plants um or I'll like screen off a corner down here, I like taped off a corner so there's like a little kind of like a cave they can come into. I, I've built artificial nests with grass and stuff like that just to kind of promote them to, to lay and sit. And, and I had them, they laid a lot of eggs earlier and I actually grabbed all those eggs and put them in an incubator because they, they didn't start sitting on them. And once I pulled all of those eggs out and let them start again, then this hen, she started, she built a little nest in here. And, started laying and and she's been sitting really tight for about three days now so i hope that she can hatch him out and and do that and you know and be able to raise the chicks up it'd be a lot of fun and so um you know typically for quail you know a three to one ratio is 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 really good three females to one male um you usually will have pretty high fertility rates um if you have just one male and one female lots of times the male will will uh he'll, he'll kind of harass the female and could even kill her you know kind of be a little aggressive towards her but um if we come over here on the other side i i have four males over here let's see where they're at oh, oh they're all they're hiding down in here i don't know if we'll be able to see them so I have three gray males and and one uh, dark male. Yeah, you can't see them. Sorry about that. They're kind of back up in this corner. One just walked off right there. Um, yeah, so I have four males over here. So I'm hoping that I can hatch out some of my some of these babies and raise them up. And if I have some hens, then we'll we'll keep them and throw them into the other cage. So if you guys ever if you guys have anything that you'd like me to talk about or show you on the button quail. Um, you know, they, I feed them uh, a game bird mash, you know, that's for quail or pheasants. Uh, and usually once or twice a week, I'll run to the pet store and buy like a dozen crickets and throw them in here or, or mealworms. They really enjoy insects. They'll eat those up. Um, I'll, I'll give them the egg food that I feed my birds. They eat that. They love that. You know, and so, so they've done really well. And so... Hopefully they can hatch out these chicks and if they hatch out, I'll, I'll do a video up close. I'll, I'll get inside the aviary and show you. I just didn't want to get inside the aviary today and disturb the hen <clears throat> and push her off her nest. So we'll wait a couple weeks and once they hatch, I'll get inside there and show you guys the babies that, that hatch out. And so, but so yeah, if you guys have any questions on button quail, please let me know. I'd be happy to, happy to help or, or make a video on something specific for you. Just let me know guys. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching.